I went to the Statue of Liberty, and, well, if you make it through this video, you win. Because I barely can. I don't even remember the day. It's just so nuts. I go bloody insane. But it is definitely hilarious. First, I went to reclaim the statues. Wait, sorry, what? Hola, como you are? Don't die. We reclaim what is mine. These Americans, they take, they take, they take. But they never give. They I take back my statue. Ah. My love, time to bring you back to Tommy. <laughs> Going to come back home with me. I stand your <laughs> Draw me, draw me now. Draw me sexy. <laughs> I miss my hometown. Paris. I liked growing up there. I was taught never say thank you, never say please <laughs> on everything. I see dry floor. I pee on it. It called me. I'm going to make love to her. Mm. Baby. Oh, baby, Liberty. Tommy. Go not lay with Liberty, I am. Gonna make a bloody bit of love to Statue. She's a very impressive woman. Gonna go down Statue, light up her torch, if you know what I mean. Have a little prowl round. And it'll be a bloody lovely day out, won't it? Bloody hell. Never seen such disorganisation in my life. This is a bloody nightmare. May as well call this a riot. <laughs> Wouldn't have this sort of trouble in Loughborough, would you? I'd like to make this for my little YouTube vlog because I've been making. Um, if you've been keeping up with them, thank you for all your favourites, all your views, all your super chats. I massively appreciate it. Very comfy, very comfy indeed. Oh. I have been made sick by this American culture. I go to the island, I climb up the statue, and I impregnate her from the inside. Culture is knowing the difference between art and poo poo. But if you are really smart, you will make art out of the poo poo. Right, everyone, I've been awake for 18 hours now. These sort of stages of delirium are hitting me quite intensely. I can't remember why I'm here, where I am. I just know that I'm a YouTube vlogger and I need more super chats. I sort of miss my hometown life. I don't know where I am anymore. I'm a gamer. I'm not meant to be here. How crazy is this? The closer we get, the bigger it gets. My oh my. Oh, long way down. Ooh. Zoo wee mama. I remember being just a young boy from New Orleans. Getting up in the morning, working. I've never worked a day in my life, I don't know why. Working all day, every day, and coming home to my mama. This statue represents every last shred of dignity in my bloody bone. This is a pick, isn't it? Hiya. 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 It's fine. Excuse me, you're filming it and not me. Sorry. Do you think there's like a murderer on this boat? There's probably one. There's probably a murderer. Oh, so, oh sorry, we touched hands. Oh, 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 oh my goodness gracious me. Haha. <laughs> Hi. My name's Tom. Tom Simons. Nice to meet me. This is a penny. This is not your in, but it's a signal of all my hopes and dreams. Asparagus. Today I'm going to be your tour guide for the statue El Liberty. It was originally made by the French and given to the Americans out of pity. The American people don't quite understand, how do I say this lightly, anything. We're here! And I love the moment. The heat is really getting to me. I don't know if you can tell. As each day has gone by, I've been getting a little more delirious, a little more sort of, you know, insane. Perhaps it's the lack of friendship I've had. Perhaps it is the only interacting with strangers. Perhaps it is the urine I'm drinking. But either or, I'm feeling a little more c -c -c crazy. Bloody good drink for a bloody good boy. Hi, I'm Kyle Roger Bottom, CEO and founder of the Statue of Liberty. And today, I'm gonna to take you up, my little darling princess, uh, and we're gonna find out what's inside the statue. All the secrets will be revealed. <laughs> Come on, there's my little darling. Oh, and there's a bug there. All right, I'll sort of entrap that in. Uh, now, this little bug here is a invasive species. Ooh, it's come to the US, similar to uh, me and uh, the coronavirus. I'll be keeping you in there. 
naughty, naughty, isn't it? Not allowed to invade other people's personal space, I've been told many times. You have personal space and intimate space. And you can't cross either! So we have this big statue here. The point of it is still un remarkably unclear. Um, how do we enter up its urethra? People often ask me, Tom, what is it like having an internet superstar? And I always reply to them, I don't know. I have dementia. All I know is I've been making fun, friendly daily vlogs for 10 days now. And each day that goes by, I feel a little worse about myself. I want to be strong. I want to look good. I want to be the Statue of Liberty too. She's so majestic and hot. Oh, she's real big, ain't she? Or maybe I'm just getting smaller. I haven't pooed in three years. You told so big. Oh, I'm so free. There's so much freedom right now. I asked the people, can I go up the statue? They said, no, no, sold out. What does that mean? I need to be more like her. I need to become Tom Liberty. Statue of Liberty, she's so freeing. Statue of Liberty, there's no memeing. Statue of Liberty, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? She'll make your dreams come true. She made my dreams come true. I didn't know women could be that huge, that tall, but they are. How to inside the most beautiful Woman. Four tips on how to attract beautiful woman. Tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me. Oh. So, how can you attract beautiful women? Tell me, so, Dan Bacon. When you see a woman and think yeah. that she is beautiful, yeah, she is. it doesn't necessarily mean that every other guy thinks she is beautiful. It also doesn't necessarily mean that she thinks she is beautiful. I've just found out that most women don't know they're beautiful. That's news to me. I thought all women cherished their faces. Wow. Look at that backside. Look at that scar. When I see her, I think, fuck, that's a woman that don't know she ho she, she pogger. In order to truly emphasize her beauty to her, I must get to her height. She'll hear me from there. I'm coming, Libby. She'll hear me from here. All right, everybody. It's time for the daily. <laughs> it's time for the daily Tom Simon sing and dance off. Libby edition. You're insecure. You're insecure. I know what for. You're insecure. If only the Statue of Liberty would have intercourse with me. Darling. Darling. It's me, Tom. Don't turn your back on me now. You're very, very beautiful. You're very hot. You've got a wonderful scarf. There are sheath. Over your, over your glorious hips. Do not be a fool. Because you're beautiful. <sighs> Let me. <sighs> Tip number two. Be aware of the reality that she lives in. Well, she's a statue, first of all. You know what? You know what? This very sexist man, he, he has absolutely no idea. All you need to do is, is get to know one another. Get to know them. Excuse me. Do you think the statue's beautiful? Oh, all right. That's fine. Hola. Donde está la biblioteca? I need to get to know this woman. Excuse me, can I just ask you guys a quick question? So I'm just sort of trying to get into the heart of this woman I really like. I'm just wondering what would be sort of the best questions to get to know someone. Oh, she's a statue. Um, Thank you. How did you know? Ash, how did you know? I asked the guy up there, what should I do to get her attention? And he said, go hold a torch to her. Oh, Libby. Oh, Libby. Fuck! <laughs> Fuck! Shit! Shit! My ruse! Why did I know there were pencils in it? Come on, Libby. Love me! Sort of, uh, notice you've been there staring at me a lot. <laughs> Fuck, you know? You're not like the other girls. You're tall and blue and still and cold, and I think I like that. I feel like you're playing hard to get. Well, I don't really know what the point in that. Lonely on this island, is it? Just the two of us? Yes. Okay. Just me and you, isn't it? A few hundred years you've been stood there. Well, I admire the patience. But maybe now you can uh, hurry up and get into my arms. If I had to answer, yes. Yes, I will be your boyfriend. I'm not going to get married now.
You make me such a happy, happy boy, you still cold lady. I know there's a bit of a height difference, but it doesn't bother me. Maybe one of these days, once we're married, you won't be so sold out and I'll uh, climb those stairs. Am I walking in circles? Am I? Am I? <laughs> I don't think I am. Was I French when I came here? I don't remember. I don't, I just don't remember. You're so... <sighs> Married life has been getting a little tough. I don't know if I've been here only two minutes or a few years, I never know. I have taken up the liberating art of drinking. I do not know how long I have been on my island, but I am certainly feeling the terror of love. How long have I been here? <laughs> liberty, liberty. <laughs> among us, among us, am I the imposter or are you? to go home. <laughs> I don't think I'm strong enough to I've gone insane. <laughs> Let's get out of here. This island is terrible and it's a hellscape and it drives you insane. There's nothing to do, there is a big statue. You can't go up on that big seductive statue. This island is nothing and it's just a circle and it goes round and round and round and you lose sight of everything. It's just a big statue and they sell clothes of the statue. What is this? Did I even get this? Oh, but she's so hot though. Maybe I should stay. No, 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 no. I'm not cut out for married life and I'm definitely not cut out for Staten Island. Bye bye, you sick, sick. Why am I even here? <laughs> Thanks again to all you boys for all of the donations. You guys are awesome! Look at them, they're all here. They're all, they're, you're seeing them. Thanks again to Phil's of Minecraft for doing his fundraiser stream and to all my mates for chipping in. You are fucking awesome. I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs>